I'm with Matt Mullenweg, who is the founder of WordPress. Um, the extraordinary thing about WordPress, the blogging platform, is just how big it is. Matt, how big is it? I mean, it's phenomenally large. We're now up to about 17% of websites in the world are running WordPress. That's of course, there's about one in six. How did you get to be so big? How do you end up being one sixth of the internet? A big part of our success is that WordPress is open source software. So like the Wikipedia, there's not just one company working on it. There's dozens of companies and hundreds and hundreds of people that work together to make the software. So it's both very easy to use and for people to start with, and incredibly flexible. So sites as large as the Wall Street Journal yeah, can use it. Yeah. Okay, so you're about to celebrate your 10th anniversary. Well, that's coming up pretty soon. So, you know, the internet's changed dramatically in those 10 years. Maybe it's like an unfair question, but where are we going? You know, what do you see as the next big trends? What, and how is that going to change people's ability to express themselves, which is ultimately what blogging is about? It's tough. So, for WordPress, there's actually three major things that are ongoing right now that I think are going to be sort of defined in the next decade. Uh, the first, is WordPress as a content management system. So people are using it for ever and ever larger sites. Yeah. Uh, you guys, the New York Times, Wired.com, all of these are really embracing it as their, their platform. Yeah. So it's enabling traditional publishers to be a lot more responsive. Uh, two is uh, social blogging. So just the idea that blogging is becoming more connected. Yeah. So uh, social networks, the Twitters and Facebooks of the world, have actually accelerated how many people are using and reading blogs rather than slowing it down. Because if you look on Twitter, half the links on there are going to blogs. <laughs> yeah. um, and a lot of those we cover. And then finally, it's just reimagining for a touch world. And touch incorporates phones, iPads, and in the future, I think all computers will be touch. Um, you really have to think about that experience differently because people aren't, are no longer using your software at a desk. Yeah. They're using it on a couch or while walking around. Yeah. And for their own safety, you don't want them to run into a pole. No, that's fine. You need to make the software very easy to use and fast. And so that's something we're hugely focused on. And that, of course, also allows you to expand to countries where the internet is accessible through mobile devices and not necessarily through you know, desktop devices. And WordPress is available in 53 languages already, so I hope that we can expand that even more in the coming years. Man, that's absolutely fantastic. Thanks very much indeed for your time. Thank you.